In London's Lyceum Ballroom, beauty is having a ball. Every member of the audience a self-appointed judge, every judge wishing they'd never been appointed. What a responsibility, choosing the most beautiful girl in the world. From the Argentine, Graciela Guardone, who's only 17. Miss Brazil is 18. Diane Coulter from Canada is a model. The ambition of Miss France to invest in a beauty institute. She's already attracting interest. A beautician already, Jutta Danska from Germany. Effie Plumbe from Greece is a mannequin. Only the second girl ever to represent India, 23-year-old Rita Faria. Miss Ireland, Helen McMahon, is a painter. Miss Italy's most unusual experience was a journey around Australia and the Far East. Not, I hope, in bare feet. Miss Japan just wants to become a housewife. Most unusual experience for Miss South Africa was attending her first post-mortem. She's in medical research. The most unusual day for Miss United Kingdom, Jennifer Lowe, was making her first parachute jump. Hardly ties up with her ambition to live long and die happy. Most exciting day for Miss USA was when she met President Johnson. The first contestant to enter from a communist country, Miss Yugoslavia. So from 51 possibles, the judges whittle them down to the last 15. Let's have another view. And again, thank you. And here, ladies and gentlemen, is the judge's decision. In third place, 21-year-old Effie Plumby, Miss Greece. Runner-up for the title, Nikitja Marinovic from Yugoslavia, a 19-year-old fashion designer. And Miss World herself, Reta Faria, the medical student from Bombay. The first Indian girl ever to wear a swimsuit in a beauty contest, and the first from her country to win this most coveted title. But the new Miss World wants to turn down any offers of film contracts in favour of her studies. She wants to use her £2,500 prize to learn to become a gynaecologist. Now she's entitled to call herself the most beautiful girl in the world, but she'd probably much prefer the most beautiful gynaecologist.
This world. In London, the most beautiful girls from all nations compete for the title Miss World. Jennifer Lowe represents the host nation, and very well indeed. From India comes Rita Faria. She's a medical student at Bombay University. Miss Brazil is also a student with ambitions to become a film star. Blonde Miss Italy is another dazzler, and she prefers to go shoeless. Miss United States is considered one of the favorites. In all, 51 girls are entered in the contest. And the finalists pose a delightfully difficult problem. And the judges choose Miss India. She's 5 feet 8 and measures 35, 24, 35. Along with the title Miss World, she wins $7,000. Certainly the most beautiful medical student in the world. The 51 girls with a good claim to be considered the most beautiful in the world were at the Lyceum to contest the greatest prize of all in the beauty line, Miss World. How, from such a bevy of loveliness, can they be a best of all? That was up to the judges. They were a cross-section of the nations. Film star Ty Hardin was among them. Jutta Danska, a beautician, is Miss Germany. From India, Rita Faria. She is studying medicine at Bombay University. Miss Brazil is also a student, ambitious to become a film star. Black hair, black eyes, statistically impeccable. Miss Italy, notice she wears no shoes, has only one ambition at the moment, to become Miss World. Miss Greece, from a country where men like a woman to be a woman, understandably a mannequin. Jennifer Lowe, Miss United Kingdom, is a dairymaid. What an advertisement for that daily pinter. And from Yugoslavia, a lovely blonde student. And representing Brazil, India, Greece, Italy, Norway, America and Yugoslavia, these are the finalists. Judge's verdict, Miss India. This beautiful girl will go home richer by 2,500 pounds and with the applause ringing in her ears. Congratulations to Rita Faria and to India.